And now to the latest on the FBI's search of former President Trump's Mar-a-Lago home. The Justice Department adhering to a federal judge's order of filing their response to Trump's motion requesting a special master be appointed. This after the DOJ, investigators there with the DOJ say they reviewed the documents taken from Trump to weed out any attorney-client privilege conflicts. ABC's Ike Iayochi is in Washington with the latest. Today, former President Trump adding former Florida Solicitor General Christopher Kies to his defense team to assist in the criminal probe that led to the FBI to search his Mar-a-Lago home. Kies is expected to join Trump's other attorneys during his next court hearing. Meanwhile, the Justice Department, responding to a federal judge's order, expected to file a lengthy rebuttal to the request from Trump's legal team to have a special master appointed to review the classified documents seized during the raid at Mar-a-Lago to determine if any privileged materials were improperly taken by the FBI. Some experts say appointing a special master could slow down the Justice Department's investigation. Florida Judge Eileen Cannon, a Trump appointee, signaled she's inclined to grant Trump's request. But the DOJ says it's already completed their initial review, finding a limited set of materials that potentially contain attorney-client privileged information. Federal investigators removed 11 sets of classified documents from Mar-a-Lago earlier this month. That's on top of the 184 classified documents Trump handed over in January. 92 of them marked secret and 25 marked top secret. Some of those documents involved the most sensitive of classified material, including some on human intelligence, spies, electronic eavesdropping, and secrets from allies. The federal judge has set a hearing for Trump's special master request for this Thursday by 1 p.m. Ike Ajachi, ABC News, Washington.